Hello everyone, Callie Stormdoll here, and today we're going to be writing free with DreamWorks Spirit Untamed, presented by Mattel. We have the, um, this is called the Miradero Festival Doll. So these are the other two dolls you can collect. It doesn't have their names. And over here, this is who we have, and I believe her name is Prue. So on the back of the packaging, sorry about the glare, it says Lucky Spirit and Friends dress up in their finest to celebrate the festival in Miradero. Okay, and then it's in other languages. So bam! So I did pick her up from Walmart.com. If you go to Walmart right now, you will see these Spirit Untamed dolls. Make sure you type in Spirit Untamed. Because I was typing in Spirit Free and it was bringing up the other ones. So you can see it says we have the Miradero Festival, Prudence Prue, Granger, and Chica Linda. Oh, wow. Three and up, Mattel. And you can see we have some artwork from the actual movie. So it looks like it's going to be a CGI movie. Okay, what's she giving? She giving... Yeah, yeah. And her horse giving... I got a plan. Yes! So what I'm going to do now is get them open because this is the horse and everything looks like a brush of hat. Let's get it popping, boo. You know me. Yes. Let's get it popping, boo. So I personally don't have any of the other dolls. Not that I didn't want them. And I saw them in my local Target for the longest time. But I'm not really connected to the series. So, I didn't purchase. But she looked so pretty. And I said she could be a, a really cool little sister. So, and we're going to do a comparison. You know me. We're definitely going to do a comparator. To see how she stacks up with some of my other dolls. Oh my god. Look guys. We got her out of the packaging. Oh my god. Let me see if I can um lift this up some. Okay. So, let's get out Linda. Okay, let's see what Linda's gonna be given. Linda, what you giving? Listen, Linda. Yes, this is actually my first um horse as an adult collector. I used to have a lot of horses as a child, but this is my first one as an adult. And you can see she has this little um clip in the back to place Prue on. She has her saddle. Okay, so the saddle is a separate piece. Her tail is plastic. Actually, she's all plastic. Who presented? Uh oh. I know who presented this, but it's okay. So it doesn't look like we're going to get um, much in a way of articulation, which I guess is okay. I mean, if it's just, you know, just for the play factor, we don't really need a horse that's going to give too much. Alright, so I took that little tie off. So I'm actually going to release her hair. I think her hair is supposed to be behind the flowers, but I just like it like this. So she does have this flower piece that is attached, and you guys can see that. And this is Linda. Oh, her head moves. Okay. Oh, find out something new every other day. Yeah, so Linda... Listen, Linda. Yes. So this is Linda's face in the front. Linda's like a caramel complector. You can see she has a white nose and she has the white part on her feet with the little hooves, which looks so cute. Her tail doesn't move at all. It doesn't swivel or anything. Um, this is like a softer plastic, so that's pretty cool. I love that they gave her the head articulation. Okay, Mattel. That was cute. Okay, so we got Listen Linda out. So now let's get Prue. Okay, I love that they give her a comb. I low-key do want to unravel her braid. So this is the brush. So I'm sure it can be used for Prue or Linda, even though it does have the hoof on it. Mostly it's for Linda. Let's see. Does it comb through? Yes. Listen, Linda. Yes. <laughs> okay, that's cute. Look. Yes. This is a cute piece. I give them that. It's a cute piece. I wish, you know, this detail was a different color, but 
listen, Linda. I'm just going to give him a pass. This is cute. Okay. Now let's get out Prue. All right. So we have Prue out of her packaging. So you can see she has this little brown headband. I guess it's to kind of hold her curls back into place. Her ponytail is cute. It doesn't come with that, um, the blue detailing around it, like in a picture, but... And then she has another little brown tassel right there, which is really, really cute. Her hair is like a dark, deep brown complector. This is her face, which looks like it's printed on perfectly. Um, this is her dress. It's like a blue and yellow dress. Kind of give it that blue and gold kind of detailing. Down to her shoes, you can see that she is wearing these brown shoes. So as far as articulation go, Prue can move at the head she can look side to side not really tilt or anything she has movement at the shoulder she can swing back and forth she can also put her hands out like that um, as far as her leg articulation goes she can kick out this far she can kick this far forward and she has one bend at the knee and it looks like she's like a mini doll because it um yep her shoes can come right off now for those of you who are kind of like me and you're interested in her height let's get into that okay so we have her right back there so now i'm gonna get the ruler if i can find it okay so it looks like she's seven and a half inches that's not too shabby now let's see what she given okay we're gonna see if she can fit on top of linda she gonna say listen linda and she gonna get on top mind you i've never seen this show oh my god look guys is this gonna be enough space because the saddle is like right when this i guess it's supposed to be like that let's see what it's given because it's not giving me security oh this can tilt back oh that's nice okay so you just tilt this oh it comes out so this saddle piece comes out so you can clip her preset so i clipped it on her like that and now i'm gonna sit her on listen linda okay oh wow okay mattel i'm gonna give you some points you know me i'm gonna give you some points let's see her with her hat given okay it's very much so given yes wow go off per per says she going off i don't blame you sis yes she looks really good okay so now that we got that part done let's look at a few comparators so we clearly know she can ride a horse but i kind of wanted to test something else out so don't you know these that we got from Mattel, the wheelchairs I wanted to see something because um, I don't know if Mattel will ever come out with wheelchair bound children. I know they come out with um, wheelchair bound adults, but you know, just to offer you guys another insight into some of the things you can do. And she actually can look. So if you are, you know, wheelchair bound, the only thing is she can't reach the stoppers but you know to be inclusive yeah if you guys wanted to do that like because these dolls are like children so like if you wanted to let's see if she want to be fashion in her chair you want to live fashion yes okay she want to live her life fashion okay so i thought this was pretty cute yes yeah 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 Yes. all right so now you know me i love to create short stories so something else i had to see is how she compare with some other doll so we saw that she can get in the wheelchair so let's see if she can play a little good sister so this is a ken fashionista and it does so this is her height next to the ken fashionista okay we're gonna bring out um barbie a barbie made to move doll and she's like a really decent height she looks like seven or eight nine or ten she doesn't look that old you know she looks pretty good you know but let's compare her to some other children you know so these are creatable worlds oh wow she's oh 
why did I think she was going to be in, you know, I'm always trying to include people. I don't know why I thought she was going to be in scale with them. Linda. Linda. So I don't think anyone else can ride Linda. Linda must be like a tiny pony. Wow. Okay. So one more comparison I wanted to do was because I had a feeling she might be smaller, but also because I thought they were going to be the same size. I got the um, Over the Moon character out here too. She's tiny. What size are these other ones? So she's seven and a half. This girl is, damn, she's nine inches. I think they're the same height. He's 10. So seven, nine, 10, if you guys are curious. Wow. Well, all I can say is if you're looking for like a little sister companion or if you're a fan of the series, I would say definitely pick her up. Right now, they are on Walmart.com for $19.99. If they don't sell out, I know they're going to get reduced in price. Trust me. They're going to get reduced in price. Trust the doll. But some of the older dolls are really expensive right now. So if you want her, I would say, you know, and if you can, I would say go ahead and get her because she's a really cool little sister type of doll plus she comes with a cool pony so let me know what you guys think about um spirited untamed are you looking forward to the movie let me know by leaving me a comment below also let me know what you think about prue as a doll do you think she was needed or no <laughs> let me know by leaving me a comment below like share subscribe and i will see you on my next video bye